Hi everyone, this is Andre Piripolica and I'm local uh, Sacramento real estate agent. Today I want to talk about the subject about uh, sending the money to the title company. It is a hot issue. In fact, it is so hot that five years ago, uh, Sacramento Association of Realtors are making all the agents sign the disclosure. And the name of this disclosure is via fraud and electronic funds transfer advisory. The reason why it's so important is because as a buyers, uh, you guys have to be very, very careful how you transfer your funds, how you transfer earnest money deposit to the title company. So I think you guys know that as soon as you are in the contract, one of the first things that a listing agent or seller agent will do is open the escrow at local title company. And as soon as the escrow is open, usually buyers have to send EMD, which stands for earnest money deposit. It's the deposit that goes along with the contract. And when you guys have the choice to send the deposit to title company, you can do it two ways. Number one, you can physically stop by at local branch and give uh, escrow officer a check, either a personal check or a cashier check. Or secondly, you can send the money electronically. Now, when you send the money electronically, you have to be aware of hackers and scammers that exist. And so what these hackers and scammers do, they can actually uh, put a spyware in the computer that will tell the uh, hacker and scanner your email, your password to the email, and if the uh, hackers get access to your email, they actually uh, will send the email that will look like the email is coming from the title company and the email will have wire instructions where you can send the money. However, if that email comes from the hacker, the routing and accounting number are going to be altered. So if you follow those wire instructions, you're going to be sending the money to actually to hacker or to somebody who he wants you to send the money. And that is very, very dangerous. So the disclosure says that one of the things that the buyers have to do is the buyers are highly encouraged to call um, their title company, their escrow officer, and verify all the numbers with the escrow officer. And number two, what you also have to know is that whenever the scammers do send those emails at the bottom where there is like an escrow officer signature, they will alter those phone numbers as well. So what you really want to do is you really want to go to Google and search for your title company or you want to go to directly to title company where you open the uh, escrow and search for the escrow officer phone number. In other words, if uh, the escrow is open with Chicago title, you have to go to chicagotitle.com and then search for your escrow officer and only call the number that Chicago uh, title website provided. Don't ever call back uh, on the number that's at the bottom of email signature because that number might be altered. And this is what this disclosure talks about. So I hope it's very simple. Personally, I always advise my buyer of this danger. Not always that. I always tell my buyers that uh, I am more than happy to actually stop at their home, pick up the actual check and deliver it personally to the title company. And it's actually very, very convenient because in Sacramento, uh, we have several very popular title companies. They might be uh, First American, Chicago Title, and there's many title companies. And so within the title company, there are many branches. So if you're agent or if the listing agent opened the uh, escrow with uh, the company that's located in El Grove and you are located in Roseville, you don't have to drive all the way across the town just to deposit uh, that EMD, just to deposit escrow uh, money deposit. You can actually stop at your local branch give them that physical check, take a receipt, and your local title company will send, will forward that check via courier to uh, another title company, to another branch, okay? And it's made, so it's very, very convenient for you as buyers. So at the end of the video, I just wanted to summarize it. Like again, always be careful, never trust the email and never trust the uh, phone number that's in the bottom of email, always verify. Uh, as an agent, I always, uh, verify that information and I'm very careful and I always always encourage my buyers to physically drop off the check so either they can drop off the check or I offer my services where I would uh, drive to their house pick up the check and physically uh, deliver the check uh, to the title company. 
So I hope you guys found this video helpful and if you did, please do put a like and comment below. Let me know if you enjoyed this type of videos. Also, next time I'm going to be talking about home inspections, roof inspection and termite inspections. I'm going to be showing you what those inspections do check for in the house and I'm also going to show you the benefits of hiring home inspection and I'm going to be showing you what those inspections check about it. I do have a live video where I actually followed one of the inspectors recently so I'm going to be mixing uh, my video this commentary and I'm going to be showing you the actual uh, live inspection on my next video so uh, hopefully you guys uh, enjoy that content and as well and find it useful okay guys once again thank you so much and until next time bye bye